Upcoming tracks. I mean, it sounds like you have a, a hefty list of badass producers and whatnot yeah. so far. But for your upcoming EPs and LPs, who would you like to work with? I would like to work with Bud Beats. Um, actually, I interned with him now as an audio engineer, so I'm trying to get some production from him. Um, he's also going to be executive producing the next. Uh, actually, I don't know if it's going to be an album EP. We don't know yet, so we're just going to go with the flow with that. Mm -hmm. But I also want to work with uh, Franchise Beats. Um, a couple of dope ass producers here. I know usually when I hear the tag, but I can't really name on the top of my head, but I usually would like to work with who I know. I kind of have to stay, I guess, home, so to speak. Okay, I can dig that. Um, tell me a little bit about yourself. Tell me like some stuff that people don't really know about you you know like I, I know you've done a few interviews here and there <laughs> yeah. but like tell me something special about yourself something special about me yeah mm. I can say that I am a creator and I pretty much create a lot of things um I kind of could do a lot of things creative and I need to tame myself on that, that aspect of the way so I kind of do a lot of things that a lot of people don't know about. They know I sing, I rap, I write, I also produce, um, actually engineer, um, I also do graphics, but um, a lot of people really don't know that I do, you know, internet engineer, and a lot of people don't know that I can cook my ass off. Mm. <laughs> I'm half Filipina, of course, I mean, I'm like Filipina like everybody knows, but um, I can cook some dope-ass Filipino dishes, man. Got a lot of people hooked on that lumpia from my release party. So. What? Yes. Mom's got orders. Back orders for some of those. I'm about <laughs> it. I'm about it. All right. Um, so tell me a little bit about some of your future career stuff that we can look forward to. Mm, I'm coming to have a few videos already scheduled for um, that's coming off this EP, but I got a lot of dope ass um, songs coming up. I have some dope ass features on the way. I have one with Fat Boogie and Street. Um, also one with a legend named Picasso. I don't know if you guys heard of them, but they're pretty dope here. Um, I'm also going to be going out here in LA doing some little anime stuff here, anime stuff. So I got that mm. in the works. That's kind of like on the hush us because we still got some more things going on. My cat out in LA, shout out to COPD and um, all the crew out there, but yeah, we got some things in store. But um, 
of course, the OGK, got some things coming up with them, some shows with them. Um, also, a show December 16th. But I kind of want to make it a recurring thing with them, so just look out for us and our collabs. About it. And two weeks from now, not this Wednesday, but next Wednesday, yes. come check out Velarde on our stage right here at Drugstore Cowboy yes. for our uh, Blue Heron Open Jam session. Yes, yeah, going to the streets, yeah. Indeed, indeed. <laughs> Okay, how do you feel about this December 16th show that's coming up, this OGK show? I'm excited. It's actually my first show that I'm headlining for this long. Um, I'm actually looking for some musicians and stuff to go ahead and start rehearsing. I kind of want to make this a bigger, the biggest show that I've ever done. So I'm really looking forward to it. Um, it's kind of like um, going to put me on the next level as a performer, so to speak. I think I'm pretty cool about myself, but you know, it's all about building. And with this opportunity, you know, it's given me a chance to go ahead and start building more as far as my performance team and stuff like that. For sure, for sure. Once again, that's going to be December the 16th, the not so the not so locals bodies of art so show. Bodies of art, yes, sir. She's asked, she's also going to be doubling as a fashion model for yeah, that he's show. Me. He's oh yeah, he's yeah, yeah. Form, we the new slaves. It's so hard. So hard. <laughs> we the new slaves. Yes. All right, so um going back to that show, I'm rocking the bench. Going back to that show, uh how do you feel about body shaming? Body shaming. Because that's what this show is about. Pretty, yeah, the show is about that December 16th. Um, I think it's pretty whack. Speaking from my experience, you know, I'm kind of a thick girl. But um, a lot of people tell me, you know, but Lord, if you lose that weight, man, you fine, though. But if you lose that weight, man, you know, I really don't phase me, but that's our society. It's all about pleasing the eye, you know? Sex sells, but it's all about the individual. Mm -hmm. But what's being promoted is what's you know, what's vain, what's what we see, what we lust with the eye. You know, things are deeper than that. But a lot of people are surface people, so I guess you can't really please everybody with your body. You shouldn't anyway, because it's kind of nasty. <laughs> but you know, I think as young girls growing up, it's pretty hard because. You know, sometimes you could grow up, you know, with your parents and your siblings making fun of you. So you kind of think it's normal when you get into the real world when people do shame your body. You know, some people are just naturally big. Some people aren't naturally skinny. They can't help that. But I guess society has a way of saying everybody has to look like Kim Kardashian, even though half of her is fake. Mm -hmm. But half the people in the world are fake. So what are we really striving for as people? That's the question. Indeed. What's really important to you? Mm -hmm. So, it's all the vision of the individual, man. We just, we have to strive for a bigger vision. And that was being promoted to us. And then we gotta look into self. Exactly. And if we really know who we are and our purpose, we don't care what anyone says about us. We can give two fucks. Who cares? I'm still fine, bitch. I'll still take it, man. I'll still take your bitch. He's still in my DMs. How? <laughs> preach, yeah. preach. Yeah, we gotta step step up and stop being consumers and stop being yeah. just and people. Being you know, like we, we shouldn't have labels. At all. Yeah, one more time. What's your name? Velarde. I'll be that black. Check me out. I am Velarde.com. That's E V L A R D E. SoundCloud Velarde 3, that's the backslash Velarde 3. Just Google me, Velarde. I got you, man. Snapchat, right. Instagram, Twitter, real Velarde. Check me out. Velarde out. Peace.